Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about plant trophism. Animals many times respond to stimulus by moving. For example, when you come home in the afternoon, your dog will wag its tail. Plants also respond to stimulus, but many times by growing. A plant's growth response towards or away from a stimulus is called a trophism. If a plant grows towards the stimulus, it is said to show a positive trophism. If it grows away from a stimulus, it shows a negative trophism. First, touch. Some plants have what is called thigmotrophism. For example, stems of many vines such as grapes and morning glories show a positive thigmotrophism. As vines grow, they coil around any object they touch. Plants also will respond to light. When a plant exhibits a response towards light it is called phototrophism. The leaves, stems, and flowers of plants grow towards the light. Take a look at these plants growing towards light. Also respond to gravity. This is called gravitrophism. The roots show a positive gravitrophism. They grow downward with the pull of gravity. Plants are able to respond to touch, light, and gravity because they produce hormones. A plant's hormone is a chemical that affects how the plant grows and develops. One very important plant hormone is called auxin. Auxin speeds up the rate of which a plant cell will grow. Auxin controls a plant's response to light. When light shines on one side of the plant's stem, auxin moves to the shaded side of the stem. This will eventually cause the cells on the stem's shady side to grow longer and will cause the stem to bend towards the light. Let's look at another example of this. Anyway, trophism, how plants respond to stimulus. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.